We have been following breaking news all morning long on I-40. There have been two rollovers in Guadalupe County near Klein's Corners. One of them is a double fatal accident. News 13's David Romero was on the scene overnight. He joins us on the phone. David, is traffic moving yet? Well, Mike, the latest word from Torrance County deputies is that traffic is open in one lane eastbound and the other the other lane should be open within minutes. Now, these accidents all occurred at mile marker 242, which is about 85 miles east of Albuquerque. Now, the first happened just after 1130 last night. That's when state police say a pickup truck from Texas was heading eastbound on I-40 and flipped over after an altercation with a semi-truck. Now, the second trailer from that truck rolled, was also rolled on its side. And meanwhile, in the pickup truck, there were seven occupants made up of four adults and three kids. One of the adults and an eight-month-old infant were riding in the bed of the truck, and they were ejected when the truck rolled over. That baby died on the scene, as well as one of the adults that was riding inside the truck. Police also tell us that no one was, was restrained in that vehicle. One of the other kids was transported by helicopter, and the rest were also taken to UNMH, and that includes the driver of the semi-truck. Now, while crews were on this scene, another accident happened two miles west of there. Traffic that had been stopped going eastbound on I-40 started to move again when one semi struck another from behind going about 65 miles an hour. Now, this is truly amazing that nobody died in this accident because, as you can see by the video, the one of the, uh, the, the cab of the truck that struck the other from behind was almost completely demolished. However, two people that were, were eventually transported to UNM Hospital by helicopter, and they were reported to be in stable condition. Now, there's still no word yet on the cause of the fatal accident, while officers say it appears the driver in attention is the blame for the second crash. Mike, back to you. And you wonder if somebody fell asleep there. Okay, David, thank you very much for those updates this morning. State police, as well as officers from Torrance and Guadalupe counties, worked both of these scenes. Santa Rosa Fire Department also responded.